Hi, guys, welcome back to AppGeeker channel. Today I want to show you a couple of easy ways to screen record your Windows PC with computer audio. You can simply use a recording app that comes with your Windows system, or use a more powerful screen recorder software. The recording is quite simple, you just need to open the app, select what you want to record, and click on the record button to begin. Alright, let's jump in. So the first tool we're going to use is the Xbox Game Bar. It's built into your computer system on Windows 10 and Windows 11. And it's very simple to use. First, you need to open it. You can either go to search box and type Xbox Game Bar to access it, or you can also go to the start menu, select settings, gaming, and then you should see the Xbox Game Bar right here. When you reach the Xbox Game Bar, just simply enable the option. And below it, you're able to adjust the shortcuts to open and use it. Here, I'm just using its default settings. And then, you can close this window and press the Windows key together with the G button on your keyboard. This shortcut will open up the game bar automatically. You will see its toolbar show up at the top. Now, we have the ability to capture the gameplay and also other actions on the Windows screen. So, click on this speaker icon from here, you're able to record computer audio and also your voice with it. You can select the source audio you want to record. And then, we check the camera icon as well, from this capture control center. You can take a screenshot, or turn on the microphone audio while you record. And before you start recording, you'll want to know that Xbox Game Bar doesn't have the option to record your desktop or file explorer. But you can record video game, browser, and an active application on your computer screen. And when you're ready, you can click on the record button or press Windows, Alt, and their button to start. This allows you to record your computer screen and audio at the same time. However, if you're willing to record multiple displays on your screen, it might not be possible. The Xbox Game Bar can only record one active window at a time. If you switch between different apps, the Game Bar records nothing about the second app, and it even exits the recording when you do. In that case, you'll have to start the recording over again, which makes it a little bit inconvenient. To fix this problem, you can fast forward to our next method, the AppGeeker Screen Recorder will help you out. Right here, in the Xbox Game Bar, when you're done, you can end the recording by clicking the stop button on the floating bar. Also, you can make it stop by pressing the combination windows, Alt, and Q. Then your computer will inform you that the game clips have been recorded successfully. You can play the video to see whether you want to keep it. Like I said, the Xbox Game Bar is pretty easy to use. If you're searching for a basic recorder, it'll be your perfect option. However, if you'd like to record multiple applications or capture all the on-screen activities with audio on your computer, we'll highly recommend the next tool, Screen Recorder from AppGeeker. So, a useful screen recorder should have the capacity to record your screen, audio, webcam, and also the microphone sound from your computer. And that's exactly what the AppGeeker Screen Recorder offers. It's a desktop software, letting you record everything on your Windows screen in a few clicks. To create a high-quality screen recording with audio, first we download and install it on the computer. I already have it. And I'm gonna drop the download link in the description below this video. You can easily click it to explore more. You can also have a free trail to see how powerful it is. Alright, now launch it on your Windows once you got it. And for screen recording, select Video Recorder from its main interface. Right here, as you see, you can select what you want to record from your computer. You can record the full screen or a certain area. You can include your system sound as well as the microphone audio. And you can also click the gear icon to adjust more advanced settings. In the recording settings, you can set up a countdown before recording or make it record your mouse movement and show clicks. Also, if you check the output settings, you're allowed to decide the location, format, and also the quality of your recordings. So, just configure the recording settings before you start. And after going through the setup step, you can now click on the record button to record. 
Also, another wonderful feature of the screen recorder is that you can edit on your computer screen while recording. You can add drawing, shapes, arrows, and even annotations on the screen, which will give your viewers a better understanding of what's going on especially if you're recording a lesson video or creating a tutorial guide. And you can also hide and get back the floating bar by Ctrl, Alt and H combination. When the recording is complete, click on Stop button or press Ctrl, Alt and R buttons to stop recording. Once the recording ends, the preview window jumps out automatically. As you can see from here, we can do basic trimming to clip the recording file, or click the Advanced Trimmer option to access more editing options. When it's all done, feel free to export and save the recordings on your Windows PC. See? It's quite easy to record your computer screen and audio. And it offers you more features to create a more professional and flexible recording. Alright, that's the two methods you can record your Windows screen with audio at the same time. Use either the basic Xbox Game Bar or the Advanced Screen Recorder. Go create your new screen recordings now. And if you found this video helpful, please give us a like and feel free to share it. Thanks for your watching. See you next video.